Show your fuck. Shut up, bro. Everybody getting put in the bathroom. Everybody get put in the bathroom, bro. Gotta move to alternate safe room. Plan B, gentlemen. Okay, guys, let's get moving again. Get that old ho back over here. Damn, my soul. And will have consequences for you. Yep. Dumb you. Well done, that was kind of fucked up. I did it again. <laughs> To my hoods and hoodettes, y'all already know what's about to happen today. Hoodie Wick is back in the belt. They really don't let us get on a game that really had me play like John Wick. I'm out here shooting, sneaking, uh, got, um, assassinating, knocking folks out. You know what I mean? Covert operation. Big hood. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Yep, okay. yep, 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 yep. yep. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another Hitman 3 gameplay video. Yo, last time we played this game, I had a whole lot of fun. We was acting crazy. We were real unorthodox with it because I did the training after I did the first mission. I'm kind of slow. So, yeah, uh, you know, shit be happening like that. So, I had to do what I had to do, you know what I'm saying? But uh, at the end of the day, it was still fun. It was still interesting and all of that. But now we got to get the hang of it because I definitely since then have forgotten... I've definitely forgotten uh, the controls. So, we're going to go ahead and get this game started. Because uh, if I don't start now, I'm definitely going to get even worse off of my... Look at my hair, bro. Also, wild hair. Wild hair Jay in the building. Golly. Hair is crazy. Got to get that done. But, hey, you know. It's time to get back with Agent 47. The Agent 47 hoodie Jay combo. Different. Different, y'all. They weren't ready for that. They're not ready for that. All right, let's see what y'all talking about. Nope, cancel. Uh, yeah, yeah, we can get right back into the story for real. I already did training though, so. What? 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 But I already done did that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me think. Let me think. I gotta see. But I did top of the world. So that means next is this cinematic right here. So let's uh, get out the screen real quick. I think I already watched this though, but I don't know. Everybody, everybody hush. I have watched this. I have watched this. I'd hate to see you lose. Forget that. I've already seen this. We're going to run it back for everybody who wasn't here last time. Either way, go watch that video if you haven't been here last time. We caught him once, we can do it again. And, well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. Of course not. Why would you trust her? I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did, she'll make it right. She always does. Why Agent 47 we sound like an evil line. ass villain? Like, damn. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. Can't just be me. I hope you like the rain, 47. I mean, not really, but I mean, sure. Oh, she got gloves on the end of the phone, bro. That's how you know she's doing some crazy stuff. Number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. So 
it was about to happen soon enough. I, I don't want to know. That's the question I have answered. I need an answer to that. Fuck was the point of that? Okay. So, then boom. All right, so death in the family. We about to kill it. Death in the family. Don't know what that's going. What's gonna happen? But shit, let's do it. End of line. She came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough. You tend Y'all can't tell me this man trench coat ain't sliding. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? How are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? This nigga, did he just I say guess a the fucking. The world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa right, now I'm a bump off. is now I'm a bump off. dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlyle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house, meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. It began here. And it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. So we gotta go kill an old lady and take a case file. That's all I needed to hear. That's all I needed to hear. Fine. All right. So we already briefed, I'm guessing, because we don't really need all that extra shit. We already briefed. Okay. My objectives are we got to kill Alexa Carlisle. Got to do that. That's going to happen. That don't matter. And then we got to find the case file. We have to do that as well. So we got to make sure we figure out where that is. Uh, let's see. All right. So planning. Starting location, main road. Is there a way I can change it? Oh, see, I'm not even fucking... I'm not even built like that yet. Oh, shit. All right. That's fine. Smuggled item. I See, I'm not even built like that yet. I can't even do stuff yet. For real, for real. Nah, put the, put the clean little... The clean trench coat on. You know what I'm saying? Conceal weapon. Yeah, I really don't have anything. All right, that's fine. That's fine. All right, so we already got that down. The fuck? Okay, I was about to say, bro, what you doing, bro? Okay, so then... Well, let's play then. The fuck? I'm confused. Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Professional. We professional with it. We gotta be professional with it. We can't be casual. I ain't no damn casual. Hell, I look like being a casual. While we wait, and I hope everybody having a nice day. The Carlisle family's home for countless generations. The revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson, and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now. The target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, Jed. All right, then. I'm ready, Haiki. 
We gotta get this lady up out of here, bro. She she too much of a threat to society. Hold on, let me make sure I look at the. Hold on, real quick. I'm sorry, everybody. Hold on. All right, let's do it. Ah, right, let me let me just say it real quick. This damn. First of all, why it looks so damn dark? Hold on. Dang. That is not okay. Brighten that up for y'all a little bit, goddamn. Got y'all looking like y'all in goddamn nighttime and shit. I know it's foggy, but Jesus. All right, but yeah, like I was saying though. First off, this this crib right here is huge. The birthplace of Providence and everything. Yo, they deep as shit for real. Like, so I'm guessing it wouldn't be smart to like try to go through the front door. Obviously, that'd be stupid. But this PI though. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carla this morning. Heard you. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself. 47. You know, you know, I'm a finesse it. You know, I'm a, I'm, I'm a finesse that. A famous private investigator summoned by Alexa Carlisle right. has arrived at Thornbridge Manor. Uh -huh. If you take his place, it may be an opportunity to get close to Madame Carlisle. Got you. Okay, we can talk that. And who are you? Who are you? You're huh? allowed here. What are you talking about? What do you think you're doing? What are you talking about? You have to leave. Yo, shut no, up, no. shut. Got to drag, shoddy. I'm not eliminating her. I ain't trying to dump, shut. I don't know where I'm dragging her to, though. It's the funny thing. Okay, right here. I had to figure out how to punch her. I was really confused just then. Him. I'm finna take his place. I'm going to take Birdman's place right here. Shut up. Shut up. Shut, shut up. Let me have that real quick. Let me hold your disguise real quick. Let me get you out of here. Like, dang, I should be, I gotta be S tier. I can't just be. I'm gonna have to do something about Shadi though. I'm gonna have to do something about her. I might dump her at for real. Like, I'm gonna be honest. I shouldn't have to do that though. Is there a way, a way I can keep her quiet though? Mm, let me think, let me think. How do I look at my inventory again? I definitely forgot. Okay, never mind. I found it. Found it. I know this is a legal weapon. You don't have to tell me that. All right, so let's let's get a move on. Whatever. We'll we'll, we'll figure it out as we go. It's a hearse over there. Guards every three seconds heard you. Stop looking at me, sir. Master Weed Twister. What? That's what I do, twist weeds? I bet, bro. You lying like I'm a... Okay, found, found an entrance point. Found an entrance point. Found an entrance point. They don't mess. Oh, shit. Mary is so upset. She's never seen a dead body before. Poor thing. Alexa, back from the dead. A make-believe funeral. A murder mystery. Oh, it's all too much. They will all need a vacation when this is over. What's going on right here? I need to 
stop thinking about Emma all the time, but she just makes me so angry. Bro, right, what's up with the? What's up with this? Okay. How the door? There we go. Gotta change my fit, low key. Like, dang. Kind of cool in here. I like. I like this game. This game real innovative. A lot of twists and turns, though. I'll tell you that. Where would you like to start your investigation, sir? Where's the family? I like to prime the suspects a bit. Madam Carlisle's family members are all on. And that her right there? Hey, son. Oh, she better be glad I ain't trying to go boss to the wall like this mug. Cause I definitely was ready to dump her just then. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I ain't trespassing shit. You lying like fuck. I gotta get to this man. Bear. You are bold, not easily faced, self-controlled, and always a step ahead. All qualities of murder. It's folks everywhere. Wouldn't you say? I wouldn't know, I'm afraid. If that is all, sir. Please don't come with violence. Just one question. Is there burn feather? Unusual for a bird feather. Is it burn feather? I don't I, I don't know what you what you Seeds, Mr. Bunsby. I need to become a mansion staff member. Come on. You know you want to look. All right, now. Move too slow if you want. Shut up. Yep, 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 yep. Pull you in here. Uh-huh. Hold that disguise. Appreciate you. Now. We putting you right up in here. Yep, we dumping you right in here. You sit on in there, sir. Close the door, please. Thank you. And we gonna close this one. All right, cool. Where where that PI go? Ah, uh, interesting. Blend into maintenance. Okay, so I'm, I'm I'm doing my thing now. Okay, I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm on it. First off, Lord, do y'all see this room, bro? Bro. Jesus, I ain't gonna lie, I wouldn't even be mad to stand in this mug. This thing clean, dog. Real clean. But who the hell is you? Cover my tracks and stuff. Oh, he coming through here? Oh, hold on. I want to, I want to, bro, I want to do it right here, but it would be very dumb to do it right here. Oh, he done messed up. If, he, if you going outside, sir, you're messing up. I'm going to get him. I'm going to go get him. If you're dressed like a Detective 47, you might as well act the detective. I suggest you go talk to the butler. They don't see me, Nick. Who the butler is? Who the butler is? He don't see me. What y'all talking about? Just give it a second. Give it a second. Yep, select the camera, put the camera away. Smart, smart, smart moves, smart moves. Mm-hmm. Mr. Fernsby, I'm ready to see. 
Mr. Whitmer, are you ready to inspect the crime scene now? For sure! Mr. Fernsby, I'm ready to see the crime scene. Very well, Mr. Whitmer. If you'll follow me, sir. You'll have to calm down and tell me what's happening. I bet you're a great dancer. I don't like dancing. What about rhythm? My boys, you all right? I feel obliged to point out. You all right, my boy? The affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. It's so weird how everybody here is so okay with this. Like, who the hell fakes a fucking funeral? Like, so please bear with them if they seem affected by the rather unusual situation. I trust I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madame Carlyle is still alive. Oh, she's not gonna be alive after today. Dead when I leave. Before you inspect the crime scene, I will tell you this: the case concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. Right. He was found dead in his bed this morning. Uh huh. The door was locked from the inside. And a suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play. Foul play by who? That he took his own life. I've prepared some information for you, so please do come and see me when you're finished your investigation of the crime scene. This I got is you, Coach. Room, to my right. Appreciate your appreciate your little, your, hi, your house vitality, sir. Appreciate it. Get to the bottom of this. All right. Why didn't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? My question is, why y'all still got him laying here? Like, can we really talk about this? Why is his Kill body still here? Indicate a rare, short-lived plant poison killed him. Spread shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. I definitely do. Let me see. I'm finna check in this shit. Yeah, yeah, I'm scanning you. Only thing over here that sound. All right, so let me investigate. Finna big investigate this. A plant poison. Let's see. He got mad, mad different types of alcohol in here, and I'm not mad at it at all. First off, what's up with you? Let me let me, let me be a little nosy. First. Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Nah, facts. Where that letter at? That's what I need to see. Is this it? There it is. Zachary's suicide note. I need to read that shit. Wait, where is it at? Okay. Zachary's suicide note. Bro, can I not look at it though? Also, a sample of handwriting. It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish its authenticity. Where's his other writings at? His room is. Wait, not gonna cap. This thing clean. This whole house clean. Like, the only thing about it, about mansions and shit. Like that they get that they be depicting and stuff is like the dark like colors that they be using. Oh, boy, you got a boy, you lying like goddamn. You got a boy, boy, you a living, my boy. I ain't mad at it. So let me think. What else could I think about in here? Uh, what could I? Why would I? What am I gonna do? Just sit in the chair? Like what the hell would I do that for? I ain't finna be no weirdo just sitting here. Nah, bro. Is there any more writing in here? So they said, talk to him about more writing. All right, let's see. Let's see. Oh, yeah, we finna hide that real quick. Go back to the camera. Yep, boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Why did thing look like that? This means this door had to be open, right? Also, who the hell are you? 
Plants, plants, plants. They said something about a plant poisoning or something, right? He got mad plants in his room, though. I ain't gonna lie. But you got a fur rug outside, though? You lie, boy. This, this, this shit crazy. That's absolutely out of pocket. Sir. What's up, my boy? Gonna lean here real quick, you know, take a look, a look, a look, a little gander. Do they got TVs in here? Let, don't you dare tell me they don't got no TVs in this motherfucker. I'm, I'm just saying. All right, so we gotta find something. We have to find something in here. Pull a book. The fuck? Hold on. Hey. It's a secret. Uh-huh. This could explain how the door was locked from the inside. Heard you. Okay, so I know a little something, something. It's a secret door. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. wait. How many? How many have I found? I found five out of the six clues. Okay, okay. I'm on it. I'm on it then. I'm on it. I'm on it. I got to. A peep. The fuck you got peepholes for, sir? That's actually crazy. Whoa. Hmm. A photocopy of the floor plans. This Somebody's is crazy, Jit. Secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene 47. Let's really talk about Maybe this real quick. It's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Let's really talk about this though. This whole thing right here. Hold on. What is this on the other side? I need to see what this is on the other side. Let me look at this. So on this side, you think it's a mirror. It's really a one-way mirror. Heard, 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 heard. So in that case, it's like, okay, close. And whoever is stalking fool could come in here. On this side, how the hell they open it though? But how they open it though? That's what I'm trying to figure out. It had to be some. Oh, it's at the bottom. It's at the bottom of the. Okay, got you, got you. I, I'm, I'm on it. I'm on it. I do this detective shit. I do it. I get downstairs, bro. How are you today, sir? Hey, bro. I'm good, bro. Appreciate you for asking. Ain't that nice of him asking me how I'm doing? Probably messing around, knock him out later. Just cause he here, sorry. Where you going, sir? Sir! Mr. Fernsby, I'm done with the crime scene. Did you establish a time of death? Zachary died around 10 o'clock last night. That means the staff were off duty. And Madame Carlisle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. Wow. That leaves Madam's family and myself as the only persons here when he died. And before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time of death. Here's the material that I prepared. That was an alibi, dummy. Of the possible suspects and their quarters. This man said, this, this motherfucker right here really just said, I don't have an alibi, right? Before you ask, I don't have an alibi. But then he gives me an alibi by saying, I was just in my room at the time of death. Like, what? Like, that was your alibi? Oh, okay. All right. Hopefully that will help you keep track of your findings. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you've solved the case. Well, hurry up, my boy. To Madame Carlisle. All right, got you. So, where I need this to go is now. very useful information, 47. Gregory Carlisle, Edward. Rebecca, Emma, Patrick, and Mr. Frensby questioned. I didn't even question this motherfucker, to be honest with you. To really keep it a buck fifty, I haven't done anything. Wait, so how do I get to their quarters, though? One solve a murder mystery, 47. Most associates in certain locations of interest. I May I suggest you ask the suspects for alibis? Or hey, perhaps yeah. you prefer searching the manor for clues first? No, we asking for alibis first, my boy. 
Hey, Cypher, who you is? Greg, my boy. Gregory Carlyle. Can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Oh, you're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Yup. Well, um, I left Thornbridge around half eight for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't <laughs> quiz night at the inn. On the other hand, staying here with Zachary, my obnoxious sister, and the wife sporting another one of her headaches would have been a fate worse than death. <laughs> uh, the, the short of it, Zachary was very much alive when we left. Okay. I for the last shout, and I was back here just before midnight. Is that all? Not very thorough, are you? Oh, I'm walking off. I'm walking off. Emma, right? Emma Carlyle, can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Surely I'm not a suspect. I need to account for everyone. Well, I spent the evening with my family, but I got an awful migraine and had to take to bed. Everyone can attest to that. I believe I went up when the boys sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. Is that all? Heard you. That's all I needed to hear from you two. Okay. So at the eight thirty. Okay, we're about to go this way. It seems like somebody interested is in here, so I'm gonna go talk to them. Open the door. Close the door. Y'all got goddamn animal sculptures and shit in here. I'm oh, not even. Uh, Ma'am. I bet mother spent the last week at her Cypress estate. Currently right. busy. I don't no, give a damn what she now. is. Oh, come on. All right. You need to know what's going on. It affects me too, you know. Better scan that shit. What are you talking about? Excuse me, ma'am. Thank you. Can you tell me about yesterday evening? We don't really see much of each other, my brothers and I. I suppose it takes our mother's funeral to bring us together, and even then, it's not like we sit on each other's laps. Now, let's see. Patrick, Gregory's son, disappeared straight after dinner. Well, he had dinner. You know, I think he might be in some sort of trouble. Edward wanted to go as well, but Gregory convinced him to stay for a few drinks before they went off for a pint at the local at a quarter to nine. I swear Gregory enjoys Edward's discomfort over staying here. I had a conference call with my New York office at nine, so I spent three hours on my laptop in my room mm -hmm. and went straight to bed afterwards. I don't know about Emma. She did act a bit strange. Mm -hmm. You know, I bet she was making lists for changes needing to be done once she gets her hands on Thornbridge Manor. Quite the shock she had when mm. Mother arrived during breakfast. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Nah. Wait, hey, hey, hey. about Zachary. Did he act strange last night? I didn't ask everybody questions for him. He was a lot more chatty than usual. Mm hmm He wanted to know about my connections in the publishing business. Right. Apparently, a friend of his is writing a book. Which strikes me as very peculiar. I didn't think he had any friends. Is that everything, Mr. Whitmer? I do have a lot of Anything else you feel like mentioning? I may be wrong, but I saw Mr. Fernsby, the butler leave Zachary's room early this afternoon. And he seemed a bit startled when he saw me in the hallway. It's probably nothing. Oh, and one more thing. Please be kind to Edward. He can only take so much. I shall. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Nah, I appreciate that though. You probably the biggest help I done had out this mug. Hey, uh. Hey, ho. Go all back up in here real quick. What for who's Greg, my boy? I got some more questions about Togu for, for Tell Greg. Tell me about Zachary. Zach, <laughs> such a sad old sod. A bit heavy on the bottle, but who could blame him? The only company he had was his rare plants and mother, who travels more than she stays here. Honestly, I can't say which is the bigger ball. He's better off dead. Anything else you want to pry from me? Anything else you'd like to tell me? Nothing, really. I'm just enjoying the show. Our perfect mother obviously fucked up, didn't she? Faking her own death. Yeah. Uh, she's explained nothing to us. I think she's scared to own up to her own mistake. Got you. You. How did tell you me about that. Zachary. I might as well be honest. His presence was always awkward. How do you have a meaningful conversation with a man who only cares about plants? In my opinion, Alexa bears some responsibility for how this ended. 
She supported his self-limiting behavior by letting him live here. Anything else you want to know? Suspicious activity. Out of the ordinary. Nothing special comes to mind, except perhaps I did get a feeling that Zachary was depressed, not just sad. I suppose he realized that he had no one with Alexa gone. Even Alexa must feel the pangs of guilt over that one, letting him believe she was dead. Then again, guilt isn't her strong suit. All right. Appreciate that, appreciate that, appreciate that. Kick this door open. Are you of interest, sir? Edward. Edward, I need you to get the hell up off this damn piano. Get your grand piano playing ass to... What is this? You. Professor Edward Carlyle, can you tell me your whereabouts for last night? Oh, yes, this dreadful business with Zachary. I stay at the local inn. You see, I prefer not to spend the night here at Thornbridge Manor. My brother Gregory came along for a nightcap. He would never admit it, but I think he understands that I find this whole thing upsetting and wanted to provide some comfort. He's very soft spoken. I believe we went to the Stag's Head around half past eight. If that's all, I have a speech to write. Nope, you're gonna have to wait. Zachary's behavior last night. I certainly didn't expect him to commit suicide. Sure, he was upset by mother's supposed dad. You were. But he seemed more engaged than usual. You should ask Rebecca, they had a long talk. Did you know that he hadn't left Thornbridge Manor in nearly 50 years? Whoa! Aunts, mother, and the staff. Anything else I can Did you notice anything else out of the ordinary? You mean apart from the fact that we came here to bury our mother and she shows up alive and kicking? Zachary found dead in his bed this morning? Or perhaps that the planned funeral is still taking place and I have to do the eulogy? And mother will surely have strong opinion on it afterwards. I can't breathe. Excuse me. Okay, out of everybody, he probably the least threatening motherfucker in here, but... You never count out. You never can count. You never, you never give anybody the benefit of the doubt out here. Never, never do it. I don't know how to handle this whole situation. I don't think I can. Edward's speech. Handwriting does not match. Okay, cool. I need to find these rooms, bro. Sound like I need to go up the stairs. I mean, walking through all types of shit. What, what is this? Staff, toilet. I'm not trying to go to the bathroom, so. Let me find these rooms, bro. I know y'all got mad rooms up here. So let me go on up these stairs real quick. Uh huh. I really am impersonating a whole detective out here. Hey, where these folks' room at, bro? I'm finna find somebody's room. Somebody finna have to show me their room. Uh oh, it's one right here. That is the door to Rebecca's room. I don't got a lockpick right now. Thought it was gonna be like a little secret compartment. Let's see. Oh, it's another floor, bro. Oh my god. Oh no, I ain't about to go duh. Gotta find more rooms though. Have to find more rooms. I might just have to go upstairs. Sorry, sir. You don't appear on my list, so you need to go. My bad, coach. That's fine. Split your fucking wig, sir. Keep playing with me. That's fine. I don't gotta talk to you right now. I'll see about you. I'll see about you later. Where the bedrooms at, bro? This shit too big, bro. I, that, this is why I couldn't even live nowhere like this. Library. I'm trying to just find bedrooms. I could care less about a library, bro. Hey, so I think, uh, so I 
Yeah, what uh, you said. Yeah, same. Uh huh. I walk past and they automatically stop. Like, y'all knew y'all not supposed to be doing that. Motherfucker just gonna stroll up into me like that? You is not cool. Alright, let me let me see. I gotta I gotta I gotta make some moves. I gotta make some moves. Gotta make some moves, y'all. It's the fact that these missions really take like 40 minutes. It, um, it's already been about 40 minutes in this motherfucker. That's where I came in at. Nope. I'm just walking through this house all up through everywhere, man. My fault, bro. What the hell happened to bro man body, though? What's this? Now nah, I'm gonna keep it pushing. We still gotta find the case file. I just thought about that. What's outside? Who is that? It's some in that area, and I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna find it though. So boom. Whoa, what was that? Footprints. Let me see. Miscellaneous. I don't I'm not trying to find miscellaneous stuff though. Emma and Gray. Middle Florida mansion towards the cemetery. Okay. Vegas. Okay. Oh, so it tells us where it's at. My dumbass. Alright, let's go. Come on. We gonna figure this out. Yes, I'm running through this big mansion. All right, so whose room is towards the cemetery? Middle floor. This is the middle floor for sure. Maybe it's on this side. Bathroom. A key. Pay attention to a key's description to find. I don't got a crowbar. I don't got a lockpick. I don't got shit, bro. That door leads to Emma and Gregory's room. Don't be stupid. Stop acting like you didn't. Hey! Next head to be traumatized is yours! Please, sir, I need you to stop. Hey, you will stop! Yep. Shut him up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I don't care. I don't care about none of that. Y'all both getting put in the bathroom. Both y'all getting dumped in here together. Definitely not right here. Hold it, mister. Shut up, bro. Lord, this got out of pocket real quick. It got real out of pocket real quick.
Somebody outside the door, bro. Somebody's gonna have to die. Let, let's. Show your Shut up, bro. Everybody getting put in the bathroom. Everybody get put in the bathroom, bro. Pass this mug. See if I can. Let me see if I can finesse my way into a window or something. Ain't no way he. There's no way he's walking on this like it's nothing. Look at this man. He's like not even phased. Like I would feel. I'm. I'm. I'm dead for real. I would feel. I would feel like I would have been feel. All right, bro. We gotta move quick now. We already done, we already done did some foolishness. All right, so let's see what we got. Well, we see what we can find in here. Oh, not that's not what I want. All right, some over here, right? That is not what I was trying to do, but okay. What's this? A walking cane? Are you serious? Letter from now. This is interesting. Forty seven. Hmm. A letter from Emma's mother stating that Emma is the illegitimate child of Alexa's late older brother, Montgomery. And listen to this. She claims to have witnessed Alexa and Zachary murder him. The plot thickens. Whoa. Missing propane. I'm bouncing, bro. What the fuck is the case file? Let me see. Oh, Intel, Intel, Intel. Uh, I found. Three or four clues found. So I'm missing something? Hold on, bud. Y'all thought this... Nah, 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 G. I'm finna find everything in here. Watch out. Hold on. I thought this was... Y'all thought I was gonna find it? Hold on. Ain't that... Something in here. Come on. We gonna find something. Might be something out here. Okay. There's something in here that I haven't found yet. Act like I want to use this shit on somebody. How the hell can I not find it though? Now nah, I feel like I'm playing out now. What's that game called? Something in here, bro. Keychain pendant Boom. for the Found it. All right. What's that doing in Emma and Gregory's room, I wonder? And why is the key missing?
That's a goddamn door. Alright, bro. Where'd they go? They ain't no What the fuck? They all just dipped. Hold on. And slow. Hit the deck. I will shoot you. Keep your hand out to my hollow pointed friends. We've got a fist fight. I hit you. Gotta bring you down. Bro, stop lying, Nick. Damn. At this point, it's 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 up. We, we up. It's up now. It's up with it. Everybody know it, only, it can only be so long where you can be. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I knew that. I knew it was gonna happen. I just knew that was about to happen. Hold on, let me move my... I just realized this is kind of in the way. There we go. We're going to put that right there. Load it. Ah. Yeah, I mean, this is the closest thing we got. Confirm. We got to find the case file. Let me become a bodyguard. That's what I'm about to do. I'm about to switch to a bodyguard. Oh, I actually. Not even the same motherfucker no more, which I thought this was. Everybody down there, eh? Let me pull up then. Now, where's that upstairs area? I, I need to see what's up here. Something has to be going on up here. Take it easy, man. Yes, yeah, I need you, folks. Is that the case file? I think I found it. I think I just found it. Let's see if I can zoom in. How can I zoom in? There. That has to be it. All right, bet. So, in that case, I'm finna knock this motherfucker out. You finna get hit with that shit. Oh, bet. Bet that. You getting big dumped. Hold that. Body hidden. Cool. Alright. Case file. Case file. Case file. Case file. Case file. Is this not it? Is that not it? Nope. It's somewhere in here, though. What the hell is this? I could care less if I'm in Madame Carla's office. I bet that's where she keeps the file on Arthur Edwards. Oh, we just finding shit now, huh? So everybody got peepholes on people in here? This is weird. Where the safe at? Let me find that safe. I ain't trespassing. What you talking about? Hold 
Hold on, put that back, put that back, put that back, put that back. I don't need that thing in my hand. The safe, huh? Where is the safe at, though? Bro, these missions really, like, they really be testing your intelligence for real. Like, oh my god. Is there a safe in here? Oh! No, that's a little shoot again. Okay. Okay. It's a big ass office for one little old lady, uh. I ain't gonna cap. What that so it has to be in here somewhere. There is no way this is just a room. Something going on in this damn room. Close the damn door. Thank you. Find the case file? Wait a minute. Why do I see that type behind the Doberman patient? What is it about this say about this picture right here though? Something about this picture. I don't know what to do though. That's what I'm trying to figure it out. The fuck? Dump him real quick. I gotta think about how I can get in there. Got that as well, so they don't come in here. See, I'm over here trying to figure out. I'm trying to find the case file now. I'm gonna bust her and dip, like real talk. So it's this. How do I get behind this though? So it is back there. It definitely is. On reality. Now I got free reign up here. Gonna have to find. I gotta find something in here. Hey, who are you? He's following me. Bathroom. Ah. Uh. I still ain't been in. I still haven't been in either of those rooms, bro. I don't even care about this damn. Oh, I'm dumb. Oh, 
I'm not as... Bro, I need... Bro, how can I not get behind this, bro? Don't tell me I need a crowbar just for that, bro. Don't tell me, Yash. I'm confused. I'm so confused. Get past y'all real quick. I'm gonna find me a crowbar and I'm gonna come right back up there. I'm taking that motherfucker down. Let me go outside, bro. That is Alexa Carlisle. Unofficial leader Hello, of the Provenance Partners, really and last one to be alive. Hey, stop right there! They stopped up. That's a token for a vault in the Milton Fitzpatrick London Bank. You need a pair, and you gain access no questions asked. I bet that's where Madame Carlyle keeps a copy of the Edwards file. Fucking kidding me, bro? Alright, hold on. Let me see. That's a what? What did I just get? What did I just get? Okay, so. Fuck a bank token. But where's his office at? Alright, so what I need to do is I need to figure out wherever the hell his damn room is because I definitely don't know. Ground floor. Do the storage room in the oh hold on then so it's through here oh but he is such a gentleman he gave me his coat and all rosie you need to forget about patrick no good's gonna come of it stick to your own kind you mean like chris he treated me like shit all he wanted to do was to that is the door to Boom. mr fern's oh, no. Painkillers. Lethal if you use enough of them. But not the poison used to kill Zachary. Of course, Madame Carlyle doesn't know that. Are you considering to frame the butler for mm. Zachary's diary. This is big. He was about to confess to the world that he and Alexa murdered their older brother Montgomery 46 years ago. Right. And apparently, Mr. Fernsby helped make them. Murder Good, three and three. Like an accident. And 47. The handwriting doesn't match the suicide letter in his room, proving he didn't write it himself. Mr. Fernsby clearly didn't commit the murder, but I think you have enough evidence to convince Madame Carlyle he did.
If I had the detective fitted still, shit. See if I can switch out. Let me see what happens. Eh, that's not gonna work. I said, we got to do some work now. At this point in time, I'm tired of waiting on this lady. I'm finna, I'm finna split her. I don't got time. Phil, did you find out that the vote was notarized? But how the hell did that happen? Patrick Token, the man of Carlisle's daughter. Rebecca? Yes. She's insistent, that one. She kept asking all kinds of questions. Who had the other one? Why well, I gave it to her, that sort of thing. You did make sure she didn't see you give the other one to the butler. Oh, of course. Seriously, what are you up to, mister? Oi, no more hitting people. Alpha, move on target. Ah! Oh, stop that right now, sir. You can't just bash people's heads in like that. But this game, I just be, I just be out here messing shit up. A hearse? I don't want no keys to no damn hearse, bro. I know that shit hurt. That's concussion. I'm finna do some damage out this motherfucker. Watch this. I don't care. I don't care if a body got found. At this point in time, I'm finna get real un- We not doing covert no more. I'm finna pat this man. Get the fuck out of me, them birds definitely scared me. Ah, we're not safe here. Gotta move to alternate safe room. Plan B, gentlemen. Okay, guys, let's get moving again. You're on point. Get that old hoe back over here. Damn, I sold. Bump it. Oh shit, she was finna get dumped.
Well, I said I'll get real surgical out here. Shut up. Get back to his last known position on the double. He's here. God damn, bro. There's no way this mission is that hard, bro. I know it's professional and all, but gee, hey, it's us. Lucky ass bitch. I'm just trying to figure out how to get this this thing off that. What's call it up there? Like what? Like what? What do I have to do out here? Bro, I had the key. Oh my god, I hate it here. I hate it here! They said I'm compromised? I'm hunted? Well, let me change up my outfit real quick then. Gonna change the outfit. Change the outfit. We gotta we gotta be S tier. I ain't never seen me before. What you talking about? Do you read? I've got a body on the ground, not wearing any clothes. What Rebecca had going on in here? What the fuck? Uh, boom. No. Yep. You going dirty, motherfucker, ain't you? Let's investigate everything. We finna. I don't know why I'm still pretending to do this damn I can investigation. See from the log that Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. to midnight last night. Cause if I gotta throw this motherfucker at somebody, I definitely will. No need to panic. I ain't panicking, bro. Best believe I ain't panicking. Not 
bro it's like i'm i'm uh i'm i'm really like stuck on how i can't get into this shit bro like i can't just pull this down or something like, what is it gonna take for me to get this shit off I just want to get behind it, bro. No. Like, what do I have to do to take this shit down, bro? Oh, my God. Are we serious, bro? I've been sitting here trying to figure that out for how long, bro? Oh my god. I feel literally like the slowest motherfucker alive, bro. Peculiar icons above the safe. I wonder if they might be some sort of a code. Maybe have a look around the office, 47. But what the fuck? I don't give a fuck about my office, nigga. Alright. Uh, 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 not the selfie. Boy, that man ugly as hell. All right, never mind. He said he wasn't made to be pretty. That's what he said. Is there anything that I found in here? Uh, a clock, a telescope. Oh, a clock, a telescope, a bonfire, and a moose head. Okay. Seven. Five. Okay, seven, five. What was the other thing? A telescope and a moot. Wait, a, wait, what? A, a clock, a telescope. I hear that bit. Wait, hold on. You? Is it you? One. Okay. Telescope is on the, uh, the second level, so. Nine. Nine. Okay, so. Telescope is nine. The clock is one. The moose head is five. And the bonfire is seven. Okay, so. That's taken care of. And then after that, all I gotta do is split shotting and dip. So clock is one. Telescope is nine. The bonfire is seven. Oh, okay. <laughs> that thing long as hell, bro. I'm taking it though. Good work, 47. That's the file on Arthur Edwards secured. Time to take care of Madame Carlyle. God damn right. I'm walking straight past this man. Which one of these guards got a rifle on him? I'm finna air this hole out. I'm finna air this shit out. If you're from alone, you know we air shit out. He got a rifle though.
Good to know, huh? Hey, my boy. What about that strap you had, bro? The fuck? We just gonna leave. I ain't gonna lie on this. Let me hold that. Let me hold that real quick, my boy. You need to explain yourself. I demand that you return my call ASAP. Sending a junior attack. I need help! No one, for Christ's sake! God, no! Heads up! Mission complete. Well done, 47. Let's bounce. Y'all gotta stop me, fool. Out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here. Ah, ah, ah. Now I turn this, turn this shit into a bad boy scene. Fuck you talking about. Y'all gotta kill me. God damn, I got, God, come on, bro. Oh my god, bro. Oh, I did not just sell like that. Yes, bro. I'm not going all the way back to where I just got that case file. I sold on that. I ain't going to cap. That's on me. I got the case file. Okay. I still want the shop off shot it back, though. It's the fact that they didn't, he did not see that shit. It's hilarious. I'm gonna go silent. I'm gonna go silent this time. Alexa Carlyle here. You need to explain yourself. I demand that you return my call ASAP. Sending a junior attorney is gross negligence of your responsibilities and will have consequences for you. Yep. Mission you. Well done, 47. That was kind of fucked up. I did it again. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, bet. We just gotta get the fuck out of here now. Shit, nah. We gonna go out another way. And that's how we out this bitch. Out the window. Shit, all right. Thought you had something to say. I was gonna pop ya. I was gonna hit you with that. Oh, by the way, I told Kate about the Well, I thought she'd be mad. Bro, just drop down. You act like you couldn't just drop down without having. How long these people really knocked out, bro? I knocked that motherfucker out a minute ago. Like, a long time ago, bro. First of all, I want my fit back. Let me get my fit back. I don't want to wear this ugly shit no more. Yeah. 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 I don't give a damn about no unconscious witness at this point. I say, all right, say something. Bush your ass. Bounce it, bounce it, bounce it, bounce it. We out, we out, we out, we out, we out. 
Let me not mess up this. Let me not mess up this Punisher. mission. They're everywhere. Go get out. It's the Constantine. Shit. What the fuck happened, bro? What happened, bro? Y'all tell me y'all done did some crazy shit. What y'all did? We out here. Yo. I mean, okay. All right. I'm gonna be honest. I'm getting myself a grade. I give myself a B. I give myself a B. I ain't gonna hold you. Because, I mean, in reality, I did pretty damn good. So, I ain't getting nothing else, bro. Come on, bro. Don't even bother it. I give myself a B. Cause I honestly could have I could have figured that shit out way faster, bro. I didn't even really uh I should have did better than that. That's on me. Yeah. I give myself a B. They probably give me a fucking C or a D or some bullshit. But yeah. Lord. That was a good mission though. It was fun. I wish. I wish I didn't mess up my image as the detective though, as the PI. Cause that would have been great. Not getting caught caught lacking like that. I need to find I need to start having tools ahead of time, bro. Like lock picks and stuff, I need those. Who the fuck is Olivia? Let me get, let me go. Yeah. I wish there had been more time. And then there were none. Thank you, Miss Burnwood. Now, it's my turn. Bro, what the fuck? Let me get on the screen. Ain't no way they can just be killing all my folks, man. Yeah. How about now? Over here! Cover me! That's 47 right there. Walk away. <laughs> or what? You gonna take us all on? I would. Don't. Tell the constant to start running. What? You think you've won? Forty-seven is out there, and forty-seven never misses his mark. I mean, I did a little bit, but I'm still John Wick out here. That's the constant. He looked like he'll be somebody called the constant. Why? Like, you think I would betray forty-seven? Trust me. You owe him nothing. What is this? I told you we could help each other. And I meant it. I'll look forward to your call. Gray is gone. Go to Berlin and stay out of sight. all that's left now damn bro what the fuck they killed my homie man well he killed himself but still bro that shit lame uh not apex predator like what man uh, that's some bullshit see Lame as hell, man. Man, I would say, oh yeah, let's do some, let's like look at some stuff on here, but like, it's definitely already been an hour and thirty minutes of me playing this, so I ain't gonna hold on any longer. But yo, obviously, obviously, I need to work on my, I need to work on some of my skills. My deduction skills need some help. You know what I mean? So I definitely. I definitely could have figured that out way faster, bro. To my hoods and hoodettes, don't worry. We still like, we still like John Wick out here. It don't matter. It doesn't matter. 
We still like Big John. I, why am I struggling to fucking enhance this, bro? What am I doing? That's gonna be fine today. But yeah, let me go ahead and take this off. Yo. Yeah. We I could I'm gonna be honest, we I could have finished that mission a long time ago. But if I would the thing I think the thing that really messed me up was that I really got like into the role of being the fucking PI. So I wasn't even worried about I, I stopped worrying about the case file and shit and killing her for a second just to like, you know, like to actually play this role so they wouldn't really suspect me. Then when that role came went out the window, I was still doing this shit for that role. Like when I really could have just went and like figured figured out what the case file was. Cause I obviously knew the case file was gonna be somewhere hidden. Like everybody could have everybody could have put two and two together and figured that out. But you know. Uh I still don't feel like it was a bad gameplay. I still feel like we had some fun. A bunch of crazy stuff, you know, we getting shot at and all types of stupid stuff. But in the end of the day, I'm still having fun with this. Uh I hope y'all are having fun watching this and enjoying this. I'm hoping I'm entertaining y'all to the best of my ability and everybody's enjoying. As I hope y'all been seeing that I'm streaming more often. Yes, on YouTube, Twitch, you now, all of the above. So I'm gonna put all of those in the description box below. Because I cannot have y'all missing out. Follow yo, yo, follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter for all updates, bro. I'm telling y'all, that's about to be my main, that's about to be my main thing for updating y'all is Twitter. But uh other than that, yo, I need a haircut, but we ain't gonna talk about that. Don't worry about the hair, wild hair, Jay. Uh, other than that, I love y'all. Y'all know how it is. Hoods and hoodheads. Y'all, y'all just got, y'all, y'all just know. It's your boy Hoodie Jay. Make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. Yo, yo, yo. I already done spoke a lot. Y'all already know what I had to say. Love y'all. Y'all be easy. Stay safe out here because you know these folks crazy. But hey, I'm going to see you on the next one. And we out.